I'm Yemi Olorontuyi. I work with the Marine Stewardship Council, where I lead our Global Accessibility Programme, and it's a programme that's designed to increase access of um, small-scale and developing world fisheries within the MSC. I think the important thing, and uh, one key thing that people recognise that we want, which is the direction we're headed to, is making sure that fisheries are sustainable. And when you invest in fisheries, either in natural fishing or in post-harvest activities, you want to be sure that that investment does not go towards damaging or compromising the state of the fisheries. And so the, um, the idea is that sustainability should always be a condition for any kind of funding of uh, fiscal investments that are going into fisheries, so that it's giving the assurance that even if the money is going to post-harvest activity or fishing activity, that this is all done in a way that's not going to compromise the ability of the fishery to continue to support generations into the future. So, and in addition to that, it also provides uh, stakeholders and fisheries with the incentive to continue to work towards sustainability if they know that demonstrating that they are sustainable would provide them with an opportunity to be able to access funding to do um, activities that would have a positive effect on people's lives and livelihoods and also of course on the sea. And the idea of rewarding fisheries and recognizing sustainability, one way you can do that is through certification which um, um, uses um, international uh, standards to provide the basis to determine that a fishery, is actually, a fishery is actually working or is sustainable. Well, um, there, there, are, there are cases where uh, governments are using uh, certification as a condition or you know, as a basis to which they uh, take decisions, for example, um, in West Australia, uh, one of the outcomes or one of the um, um, follow-ups from their certification was that the, uh, they had an opportunity to reduce uh, taxes, um, a particular tax. So that's an example where they were rewarded by um, the fact that they got um, certified. And it means that the government, um, in either releasing cash or reducing the amounts they taxed them, eventually uh, was providing some resources to the fishery, but on the condition that they were certified.